Lettuce Abound Farms grows seven different varieties of lettuce along with basil. They produce inside using no natural sunlight and just 4% of the water typically needed. Katie Pinky traveled to central Minnesota to learn more about this unique operation. This is a great way to grow food and I think this is the farm of the future. Kevin Ortenblad once was a corn and soybean farmer in Minnesota. Today, he's a lettuce farmer, farming 180 acres of vertical lettuce. We are the only aeroponic organic facility, so we did the trial and error method, which is very painful and, and it takes a long time. You snap that into place, you put it in there, and you let it grow. We have 12 systems. The systems have 1,536 heads of lettuce on them. Right now we're harvesting about 1.5 systems a week, roughly 2,000 heads of lettuce. We plan to get 12 to 15 heads of lettuce out of each slot. That's where the 180 acres of production is calculated. Tell us how you fertilize your lettuce and how is it different? The boom that's in there travels down and it sprays the roots on the side. And all of the watering happens inside of that system. We reuse everything that's not absorbed by the plant. Then about 12 hours before we harvest it, we take all of the nutrients away. We water with only water. We're the only company in the industry that does this. And by only using water, it will raise the sugar level in the leaves. Our lettuce will literally taste sweeter than anybody else's. What is the greatest challenge for Lettuce Abound? Marketing. Uh, being able to educate the public to let them know that this lettuce is better than the lettuce that comes out of California. That'll be five to seven days old by the time it gets here. Um, this will be 48 hours and our lettuce will taste sweeter. They will pay a little bit more, but the nutrition they get from this is off the charts better than what you grow outside because we can control the nutrition with nutrients with light. So you decided to become USDA certified organic. Why? Mainly because we were literally an organic plant to start with. We did not have to make a lot of changes. We don't have weed control. We don't have bugs. We're sealed off from the environment. So that part of it was pretty easy. The hardest part was getting the nutrient solution dialed in. You've said vertical farming is the farmer of the future. Tell us why you think that. It's something that can be taken anywhere that it wants to go to. Instead of, I don't have any land here, I can't farm. Well, you can build a building. They've been harvesting lettuce for just over a year now. It's sold in several regional supermarket chains.